Broke my fall. Surprised to see me crash. Like the fleas in your fur, I keep coming back. Three years I spent alone in the frozen Antarctic waves. And I missed you. And so I've organized a little gathering, like a birthday party, except the exact opposite. And look, all of your friends are here. You are so very popular. Let's start handing out the presents. Meet your brand new hydraulically operated twin brother, Mecha Bandicoot. What was I doing? Of course I was. Initiate missile attack. Oh well, a power crystal. Yes, the crystal is mine. Back, you weak-minded fool! Avert your gaze or you'll go crystal crazy! Throw me over there. Trust me. We're pals, right? Have to help me, Crash. You heard them. They want to destroy our island home. Humiliate and enslave you and steal my brain! How I envy the simple life of the tribe's folk. Living in harmony with Mother Nature, the noble boar, the humble bumblebee. Ah! An evil scientist, what do you expect? This isn't a game. Before you rise is a cathedral of diabolical genius. Scary, but in the wrong hands, this iceberg lair could do much goodness in the world. Of course, only I have the key. Observe. Away. Chip bounced? Are you sure? After the years have kind of been slow, the back of court didn't do as well as the old one. Fish? Mighty Uka Uka! I've ruined the lives of so many, I can't be expected to remember them all. I've been like a father to you. I created you, nursed you, tried to destroy you. Twins, with my mighty intellect and your vacuous stupidity, will be unbeatable. This is the Psychotron. Gateway to the infinite dimensions. Beyond our universe, somewhere between the ninth and eleventh dimensions, lies the mysterious tenth dimension. And there we must go in order to confront the evil twins, steal the riches, and restore the natural order of things with me on top. We require six power crystals in order to make the leap, and we have... Four. Hmm. Let's see. That isn't enough! All is lost! Unless... There! To the sea, I tell you! Our salvation floats upon the briny blue! We must reach Engine's battleship and quickly before it sets sail! But how? Think, Cortex, think! I've never been so humiliated. No amount of treasure could ever begin to compensate. My crystals! to Perky here must be repaired and only one person can help my niece Nina Cortex isn't she delightful obviously I've made a few modifications here and there <laughs> quickly to my private dirigible set a course for Madame Amberley's Academy of Evil I miss the old alma mater as a former student myself, I'm well acquainted with the many secrets this institution holds. I'm stuck! The 
greatest evil scientist in the world! Stuck in a pipe. How could things get any worse? I'll take it from here. Get back to the airship. Make sure its mooring ropes are secure. Sweet son, Lina. Don't feel the night. With its long claws that scratch and its sharp teeth that bite. There's no need to hide. For your uncle's a monster, and he's on your side! <laughs> Nina! My adorable young niece! My, my, you're getting big! And sneaky. Put her there, little lady. I see they need some adjustment. Let me take a look. Okay, young lady, let's see what you've learned. My airship! Without it, we're stranded! Tie it to something secure, I said. Hurry, Nina, or you'll miss the bus! They found us! To the airship! Quickly! Madam Amberley! I'm an evil scientist! Come now, as we explore a new dimension! It should have been two new dimensions, but we ran out of time. Your fur is so soft and warm. Evil Crash! No! My daughter, uh, niece! We must do something! Think, Cortex, think! There they are. Let her go! Take me instead! <laughs> Victor and Moritz's stronghold of evil. This is where we wrong the rights. Sweet pastor. Oh my, I almost forgot. The treasure! That treasure is stolen property. Come on, follow me, Crash! Stay close and do what I do! It's easy! All too easy. Are you? <laughs> it's true. Blondes do have more fun.